Okay, today I'm gonna shoot these two bows, try to see which one I like for 3D better. One is a T-bow with 40 pound black max limbs. It's a 19 inch riser, and those uh, black max limbs are measured on a 17 riser, so it's a little less than 40. And then over here we have a ghost blemished recurve riser, that, I mean, uh, ILF riser that I got and I repaired. I cut it more to center. And it's got 35 pound DOS limbs. And I tuned these both. And the difference in uh, tuning was the same arrow, 10 grain washer more for the T-bow. So we're gonna go see how they shoot. This is my archery range in the backyard. And I have it set up so at the one stand, 20 yards, you could shoot 15, 20, and 25. And then, you know, moving closer back, you could either shorten it up or make it longer ranges. So we'll see what the results okay, are. Okay, this is the first time I'm shooting this PSE blemish that uh, I fixed. And I'm shooting it with 35 pound limbs um, and lighter arrows. And I'm surprised how well it shoots. I was thinking of using this for 3D, but I was wondering if it's a little light. But I guess it's not. <clears throat> this is the ghost. I cut it a little past center. Had some nicks in it. It's all fixed up nice now. And the limbs are on this one here is DOS 35 pound limbs. And I kind of know where to aim from the past. And I aimed like a <clears throat> kind of almost like my hunting bow with a heavier pounds and a heavier arrow. And look at that, that's 15. That's 20. All right, and that's 25. So I think I did pretty good you know with the bow tuning it and next I'm gonna try the uh, t-bow see how that shoots the t-bow wound up with a 10 grain extra point for tuning okay this is my t-bow 19 inch riser and I have black max 40 pound limbs okay and on a 19 inch riser they're a little less and the wood bow I didn't mention was a 17 inch riser and those dots limbs are meant for a 17 inch riser so I did a little shooting at 15, 20, and 25. And I have to decide what bow I'm gonna use because they both shoot incredibly well. When I uh, bass shaft tuned the T-bow, it just required a 10 grain washer more weight to tune correctly. That's 15. That's 20. And that's 25 and we're going to start having our local uh, 3d tournament so i have a lot of i have to figure out which bow i'm going to use i love them both i gotta say the uh, psc ghost is a lot lighter the t-bow has more mass weight oh well they both uh, shoot very well i'm lucky okay i thought i'd take a shot at 30 yards with both these bows to see because they shoot so close and uh, we'll go take a look how i did the first one i forgot when I use a light poundage bow. Instead of the middle finger to the corner of my mouth, I put the top finger to the corner of my mouth to get a little extra range, and I gap shoot. So the first one went low, and then I remembered, oh, at 30 yards, I got to change my anchor with a light bow to reach. So Okay, see that first one? Hello? And then look at this, two different bows. They're so tuned, same arrows, 10 grain difference in washer. And look at that, their, their arrows are so close at 30 yards, it's unbelievable. So now I have a big decision to make what bow I'm gonna use. I, I love the way they both shoot.